بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على أفضل المرسلين سيدنا محمد وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين بهذا آية إن ذا قرآن كريم الله سبحانه وتعالى سد إن الحسنات يذهبن السيئات Those who are good remove those that are evil Are you having trouble stopping yourself from making um, a sin? There is a big solution. Invest in it. Yes, invest in it. How? Just see around you how many people get close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because of their sins. How many sins are the reason for charging people's lives for the better. How this? Look every time you commit a sin. Let the repentance be higher than the time before it. Okay, what does it mean? It means the first time you committed a sin, ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for forgiveness. If you fail again, and do it again, then ask forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and give a charity. And the third time, ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for forgiveness, give a charity, and pray to raka'a for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the fourth time, fourth time, ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for forgiveness and give a little more charity and pray to raka'a for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the fifth time, ask Allah for forgiveness and take out a greater surety with the intention of purifying your heart and pray to Raka for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and fast one a voluntary day. With time, you will find yourself being disciplined and you will stop doing the sin. And shaitan will find that sin will bring you close and closer and close to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, more and more, and you increase your good deeds, then inshallah, he will stop encouraging you to commit sin. And all of this is not an encouragement to commit sin. Rather, what it means that if you have a sin and regret it, try to use this regret to force yourself to make more worship until you erase every sin you have done. Bad deed and sins are like dry leaves, dry leaves on the tree. And until these leaves fail off, it's necessary to move the branches of the tree with good deeds. The good deeds when a servant does, does them sincerely are like it's sweet water that give life to the hearts. This sweet, sweet water continues to flow through, through its veins until the source of evil dry up and bad deeds fail like the leaves of a dry tree. That's why the prophet gave us advice when he advised his companions to pull up a bad deed with a good deed. You, whenever you remember a sin you committed, even after a while or after dozens of years, don't ignore it, but remove it. Remove it with the good deeds and ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for acceptance and forgiveness. Just remember, in the balance of human beings, one mistakes may erase all the good you have given them. And in the scale of the Lord of mankind, glory be to him, indeed good deeds cancel out bad deeds. Ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to cleanse our heart and cleanse our mistake. Ya Rabbil Alameen. Jazakum Allah khairah.